Switzerland way the challenges next Congress and it is left the foreign workers in TH, Manila, Philippines on the last Senate session of the 17th Congress. Senator Joel Dillon Leyva on Tuesday challenged the next Congress to continue fighting the prevalence of foreign workers in the country. Dillon Leyva, who chairs the Senate Labor Committee, said the next Congress must ensure that Filipinos are being prioritized in job opportunities in the country. The Senator said this amid recent issues of illegal foreign workers in the country taking over jobs that can be done by Filipinos. Let us work together in the next Congress to ensure that only when there are no Filipinos who are capable, able and willing to issue a work permit to a foreigner, who in later said in his previous speech during the last Senate session of the 17th Congress. Let us also work together to ensure that there is a system of technology transfer to ensure that foreigners who are admitted to work in the Philippines transfer their know-how to Filipinos, he added. Dylan Leva slams Packer, BIU while recognizing the upper chamber's efforts in helping Filipino workers, Dylan Leva said the country was met with several issues pertaining to the rise of illegal workers here. Dylan Leva noted that the majority of foreign workers that are working illegally in the country are Chinese nationals who are working Philippine, offshore gaming operators, hodo, industry. Read, the senator also slams the Philippine Amusement and Gaming Corporation, Hacker, for its failure to regulate workers in the legal gambling sector. Mississippi Kappa Nassau Nassau Kappadang Panon, Bangkam Swizzle Sop and Sadang Pastor Piro Nanpamasatang Pogo, Napogo Narinang Paging Regulator Nido. Sop Hazelot, Pogo, Mean, Pizzle, Puddle, O, Algo. Rang, Gainan Narin Pogang Nangkari Sop Hacker, Napogo. Dylan Leva said, does Pastor really perform its duty to regulate gambling in the country? Mass Punta Poteo saw a van building saw made tonight, and we found that 22 out of the 38 companies listed in the building's directory are either offshore gaming operators or offshore gaming providers. If van building Palang Poeto saw made tonight, Dylan Leva added, noting that the country is losing P3 billion pesos a month in unpaid taxes from foreign pogo workers. Likewise, Dylan Leyva also slams the drug practices within the Bureau of Immigration, BI, which is viewed as one of the reasons for the increase in the issued special working permit by the Bureau. The BI admitted that some of the specific issues referred to just that Filipinos are confident, able, and more than willing to take, such as call center representatives, electrical technicians, door guides, machine operators, and construction workers, Dylan Leyva said. We believe that one of the reasons for the huge spike in the number of issues to foreign nationals is due to the corrupt practices that are prevalent in the BI, the senator added. Dylan Leyva said that corruption is prevalent even in satellite offices, where employees ask for additional charges for faster processing of the permit. We maintain that the BI does not have the authority to issue any form of work permit. The authority to issue work permits rests with the goal because it is the only agency that has the capacity to bet whether or not a particular job can be offered to a foreigner, Dylan Leyva said. Read, read, Dylan Leyva also raised other issues related to labor in the country such as employment and underemployment, and the exodus of overseas Filipino workers. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.